Crypto Slow, Cryptocurrency News and Investing. Crypto Slow with more crypto gains. Tonight's topic is how to fix a stuck Ravencoin wallet. And what I mean by stuck is it is failing to sync. Typically, this is the result of you updating to the latest version of the QT wallet where you replace the QT file and then you start the Raven wallet and then it just will not finish syncing or it gets stuck like two weeks behind or whatever syncing headers. So there's a couple things that are very important to this process. Number one, your wallet.dat file is the most important thing on your entire computer, right? And that typically resides in your app roaming data folder. So you hit the Windows key, percent, app data, percent, enter. You go down until you find your Raven coin and you double click it and then you'll see the wallet.dat file. Again, that is the most important file. So the very first thing you should do is co make a copy of that. Okay, so I'm assuming you made a copy of that. Okay. Um, I personally make a copy of the entire folder. As you can see, I have a, eight, eight, uh, a previous version. Um, where I copied it and that was just a precaution so you could do the same thing here and go new folder put in today's date 10 18 2018 move everything a copy of it into that folder okay so that's step one back up the raven coin folder that's in your app roaming data now this wallet.dat could be in a different location if when you um, installed it you pointed it to a different custom location and in that case I would just go to the local C drive and search for wallet.dat in the search so I'm assuming you have that copied over that's step one so step two obviously make sure you have the latest greatest wallet that's probably what's causing this problem um, from the GitHub org. I'll leave that link down below. And then again, you start your wallet, it doesn't sync. Well, this is the super nuclear version. Basically, what you do is you delete everything that is in the app data roaming Raven folder. Delete it all. Obviously, don't delete your backup, except for the wallet.dat. Again, delete everything in the app roaming data folder except for the wallet.dat now so you're going to delete that I'm pretending to delete it and then you delete it boom it's gone okay so after that's deleted you simply restart your wallet and it will do what's called rebuilding the block index. So think of the block index as kind of like your t your table of contents for your blockchain. So now let me repeat, this is the nuclear option because obviously you are deleting the blockchain download as well, right? So you're gonna have to download the whole blockchain again. Um, one quick way around that is Actually, I haven't checked lately to see if CryptoChainer has the new um, Ravencoin slipstream, which maybe it does. And if so, that could save you some time. Um, yep, they've got the Raven blockchain. So what you can do is you can also download the blockchain with a direct download, and you'll only be a week or two behind. Um, if you're not familiar with Quick Sync, um, feel free to ask some questions. I might do a video on that just to show people how to um, quickly sync. But the concept is you go to Crypto Chainer, you're going to download the Ravencoin blockchain. Okay. And let's see how big it is. It's 1.8 gigs, so it's not ginormous or anything. So you let that download, you unzip it, and then you move 
those files or unzip those files into your app roaming data. That's if you're impatient and you don't want to let the whole blockchain re-download from the peers. Um, this methodology is typically much faster than letting it fully sync. But again, the problem lies in, you know, when you start your wallet, it says rebuilding block index and all that monkey business. It's kind of like your table of contents and your organization to your blockchain download. So um, I'll probably do a follow-up video on uh, quick QT syncing, um, but hopefully you're familiar with that um, from the early days of like mining Digibyte and stuff. So that's it. That's all there is to it. Back up your wallet.dat at a minimum. Um, the next best step is to back up the entire Raven folder in your app roaming data folder and then delete everything in that folder except for the wallet.dat and then restart your wallet. And again, well, while you're doing all this deleting and moving around stuff, obviously make sure your wallet's closed. And this should fix probably most or of all of syncing issues, assuming you have downloaded the latest greatest wallet and replaced the QT executable. This is Crypto Slow. Hope you found this informative. Like, comment, subscribe. If you're not talking gains, then we're not talking.